27 local based Shikrains players will start training for the 16th staging of the Netball World Cup due to throw off on the 28th of July in Cape Town, South Africa. Three more professional players will join the team at a later stage of their preparations. Now, head coach Fred Mugera says he will build on the fitness that the players have picked up from playing the National Netball League. The good thing is that most of these players have been training in their clubs. I think their fitness level is somehow a certain, uh, certain percentage. I think we shall not need uh, a lot of time to dwell on their fitness because right now they have been playing the league. So what we are going to deal on very much is on our defensive as a, as a, as a, as a team and also the coordination, how are they going to coordinate. The Shikranes, who have participated in the last two consecutive World Cups, will look to better their performance in Cape Town. It requires teamwork. We need to work as a team. And as I said earlier on, we, need to, we are going to work on our defence. So that as much as our shooters make those, uh, those goals, we shall have to defend as much as possible to make sure that they don't score as easily. Netball Federation President Sarah Bavide Kitio has warned the Samoan players to observe discipline during the stay with the national team. So I would like to inform players and the entire country of statesmen and women that in netball, for you to qualify to play, to participate in any tournament or to be a she craze player, discipline is a key. You must be a disciplined player. It doesn't matter whether you're such a, a great netballer. As long as you're not disciplined, we can't tolerate you. The Shikranes, who are currently ranked 8th, will face New Zealand on the 29th of July before facing Trinidad and Tobago the following day. Noah Walakira, NTV Sports. She plays in the Suncorp um, for the team.